Okay, so this is um, a short 20 minute um, little flow based on sun salutation. So quite energetic. Um, you could do every morning just to get yourself going um, and to build strength and flexibility. So um, find a comfortable seat. We always start with a brief relaxation. So I want you to sit up nice and tall. Roll your shoulders back and down a few times and then just settle your hands onto your knees and close your eyes. And we'll just take a few centering breaths here. So as you breathe in, grow tall through your spine. And as you breathe out, let go of all of the air, let your shoulders soften, but keep your spine nice and upright. Go heavy through your seat. Breathe in, crown of the head lifts towards the sky. And as you breathe out, go heavy, relax, soft, release completely. We'll take a few more breaths like this. Inhale. And exhale. And then we'll flicker open the eyes. We'll just do a little warm up. So taking your hands down by the side of the body, take a breath in, stretch up towards the sky. Interlace your fingers and push your palms up. Stretch to your sideways, take another breath in here. And a breath out, take your right hand down, your left arm up, stretch the side. And then inhale, up and over, relax your neck. We'll do it once more each side. So breathe in and reach and push down through your opposite hip. Inhale up and exhale. Wonderful. All the way back. Taking a simple twist. Round to your right. Sit up nice and tall. And then round to your left. And then coming all the way up. Just take a few little circles, so circling around one way in your hips, just stretching your back out and just moving one hip to the other. Just give everything a little wriggle, a little wake up. Wonderful. And then come back to the centre. Cat cow, so come onto your hands and knees. A nice long spine. And we'll let the belly move towards the ground. Lift your chest, lift your tailbone, take a little look up. Stretch the front of the body and exhale, contract. So round your back, chin to chest, tailbone under, strong through your arms, stretch like a cat. Inhale, belly down, lift chest, lift tailbone, take a glance up. And breathe out, round, round, round and down. Push the floor away, chin to chest. Inhale, belly down. Lift chest, lift tailbone, look up. Exhale, round and down. Push the floor away, chin to chest. Inhale. And exhale. Wonderful. Come back to a neutral spine. Tuck your toes, downward facing dog. So let's make our downward dog a little bit fluid. We can bend one. Knee and push down through opposite heels. Okay, pushing through the heels. Lift the hips, give your neck a little shake out, yes and no. And then from here, we're going to push down through the heels. So your heels might be lifted, but give them a little push to stretch the back of the legs. If you need to, bend your knees if you're a bit tighter. Strong through the arms. And then we'll look forwards and step your feet towards the top of the mat. Have your feet about as wide as your hips and let yourself dangle down, stretching your legs. And again, we can keep a little fluid, just moving up and down, side to side, just to stretch your back and to start to stretch into the backs of the legs as well. Barely firm. Wonderful. And then inhale, stretch all the way up to the sky. Reach your fingertips up, open your chest and then come back to the start. 
Okay, so coming into Tadasana, mountain pose, feet together or a little apart. You're going to roll your shoulders back and down, palms forwards, <clears throat> fingertips reach towards the earth, and solid through your legs. So lift the kneecaps, tailbone slightly under belly in, crown of the head lifts towards the sky. Take a deep breath in and a breath out. A breath in, stretch your arms out and up. Look up, stretch up, lift your ribs. And a breath out, hinge from your hips, forward fold. Bend your knees as much as you need to. Inhale, take your right knee back and down, low lunge, tilt your pelvis, lift your ribs. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, forwards into plank. Exhale, drop your knees, drop yourself down to the ground. Point your toes back, squeeze belly. Inhale, cobra pose. Elbows in. Exhale, seat to heels. Downward facing dog. Step right foot forward, drop left knee, frame your front foot, tilt your pelvis, low lunge. Exhale, bring both feet to the top of the mat, take a forward fold. Inhale, stretch your arms out and up, push the palms together, look up, maybe lean back, squeeze your belly, and then exhale, come back to Tadasan. Again, other side, inhale, raise your arms. Stretch up, maybe lean back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, take the left foot back and down. This time, if you can, raise your arms, crescent lunge. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, forwards into plank pose. Exhale, lower down. Drop the knees or Chaturanga Dandasana. I'll show you on the next round. Inhale, Cobra, elbows in. Exhale, seat to heels. Downward facing dog. This time we'll hold our downward dog and take a few deep breaths here. Inhale, look forward, step left foot forward, drop the right knee, raise your arms, crescent lunge. Exhale, bring both feet, both hands to the top of the mat, and forward fold. Remember, you can bend your knees as much as you need to, don't strain. Inhale, stretch your arms out and up, push the palms together, look up, and exhale, come back. Surya Namaskar A. So different types of sun salutations. Inhale, raise your arms. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lift your gaze, lengthen your spine halfway, lift. Exhale, step into plank or jump. And lower down, Chaturanga. You can drop the knees or see if you can. Bend your arms, hover if you can, or come all the way down. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hold your downward dog and breathe. Slow the breath, steady the breath. Looking forwards. Step or jump your feet to the top of the mat. Lengthen through the spine. Exhale to forward fold. Inhale, push the palms together, stretch to the sky. Reach up, look up. And exhale, come back to mountain pose, Tadasana. Inhale, raise your arms, keep the energy flowing. Exhale, forward fold, Uttanasana. Inhale, halfway rise, look forwards. Exhale, step or hop, Chaturanga Dandasana. Remember, drop the knees or see if you can hover strong through the legs. 
Inhale to back bend, up dog or cobra. Exhale to downward facing dog. Breathe, steady the breath. Looking forward, step or jump your feet, top of the mat, lengthen through the spine. Exhale to forward fold. Inhale, stretch towards the sky, strong legs, strong belly. And exhale, come back. So, might be warming up now. I certainly am. One more Surya Namaskar A. So inhale, stretch your arms towards the sky. Lift your ribs. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway rise, lift gaze. Exhale, step or hop into Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale to up dog or cobra. Exhale to downward facing dog. Breathe. Looking forward, step or jump your feet, top of the mat, lengthen through the spine. Exhale to forward fold. Inhale, stretch towards the sky, reach up, lift up. Exhale, all the way back. So, Surya Namaskar B, Sun Salutation B. <laughs> Should have took my clothes off before we started, <laughs> but you might be stripping off too. So, some salutation B, we add chair and warrior to this flow. So, a little more energetic still. Squeeze your inner thighs together, bend your knees. Inhale, Utkatasana, chair pose, either palms together or apart. Squeeze your inner thighs. Exhale, Uttanasana, forward fold. Inhale, lift chest, lengthen spine. Exhale, step or jump, Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, up dog or to cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Right foot steps forward, left foot turns, push firmly through the feet, warrior one. Torso and hips forwards, take a glance up. Exhale, hands are flat, come back to plank and lower down, knees, chest, chin or Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale to up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Other side, left foot forward, right foot turns, come up. Warrior one, strong through the back leg. Lift the gaze. Exhale, back to plank. Lower down, Chaturanga Vandasana. Inhale to up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hold your downward dog and breathe. Steady the breath. One more here. Looking forward, step or jump your feet to the top of the mat. Lengthen through the spine. Exhale, deep forward fold. Bend the knees if you need to. Bend the knees, Utkatasana, chair pose. Sink in the hips, lift the gaze, and come back to Tadasana. One more of these. We're going to slow it down there. We'll hold each pose. So bend your knees. Inhale, chair pose. So you can have the arms together or apart. Sink the hips a little more or a little less. Keep the ribs lifted. Squeeze everything into the centre line. Keep a softness to the shoulders. Breathe. One more inhale. Exhale, Uttanasana, forward fold. Heel toe your feet out so that they're about as wide as your hips. Grab hold of your big toes with your um, fingers and thumbs. And your elbows move to the side. So you might need to have a generous bend to the knees to do this. That's fine. Don't strain your back. 
Feel that lengthening through the torso, crowd of the head moves towards the ground. Keep some firmness through pelvic floor, belly in. Couple more long deep breaths here. Inhale, lift your gaze, soften your knees, hands to floor. Step or jump into plank and lower down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, pulling it through up dog. Hold your up dog. So strong arms, wrists are underneath the shoulders, shoulders back, chest is proud, belly in. And then slowly push back, downward facing dog. Warrior one, push foot firmly and push the right foot forwards, place it on the floor, come up into warrior one, Virabhadrasana one, hold your warrior, we'll take a breath in here, and a breath out, bending the front knee, so pushing firmly, lift your ribs, push the hands together or have them apart, if you're very tight in the neck or shoulders, tilt your pelvis, one more breath here, Inhale, exhale, taking the hands flat, come back to plank and lower down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale to up dog or to cobra, squeeze your belly, bum firm, exhale, downward facing dog. Other side, left foot steps forward, right foot turns, push firmly through the feet, lift up, warrior one. So bend the front knee deeply, have the knee over the ankle if you can, tilt the pelvis, pelvis forwards. Find the breath, find your stability, your concentration. One more, take a breath in and a breath out, taking the hands flat, come back to plank, Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hold and breathe. Wonderful. So we're going to drop down onto the knees. Take the knees wide and the toes together and sit your bottom back. So we come into a nice active child's pose, but just to relax a little bit, hairy through your seat, stretch your arms forwards and take your forehead either to the ground or to a cushion or just let it hover. And then really breathe into the armpits, into the back of the body, go heavy through your hips, heavy through your armpits. And we'll take a few long deep breaths here. And just notice how you feel. Just getting that energy flowing through the sun salutations, the strength of the body moving. And then slowly, slowly come up all the way to sit. So we'll come to sit cross-legged. You can find any comfortable seat sitting up nice and tall. Just take your hands onto your knees or your lap, upright spine, close your eyes. Just taking a few breaths now. So really allow your face to soften, your jaw to relax, shoulders to release. After the effort of the movement, we then find stillness. You could say that yoga is um, the physical form of yoga. It is about moving into stillness to allow the body to be healthy, 
strong, supple, energy flowing. But the ultimate aim is to find this piece of inner stillness that's within us all. So as you just take a moment here to breathe, just allow yourself to be still. Take some deeper breaths. And flip open the eyes. Thank you, everyone. Namaste. Have a wonderful day.